Welcome back. What do Jack Benny, Elvis, and Tiny Tim all have in common? Why, it's this, the ukulele. Fashioned in Hawaii over a hundred years ago, the uke is now in the midst of a major revival. You'll hear them in the back rooms of bars, all over the internet, and even in international city streets. <laughs> This was London's Uke Fest just two weeks ago, where experts and novices gathered to break the Guinness World Record. 851 ukuleles lovingly played at the same time. So, popular, you bet. Easy to play? Uh, we'll see. Oops, here we go. All right, fix me up here. Turns out I'm lucky enough to get a private lesson. Well, hey, whatever. What good is being a TV host without some perks, right? The trick yeah. is the smoothness that you're able to go. Here's where we're going to all end up. Okay. Oh, my God. It can't be like that. Yeah, it is it, like it, that. It is, and it will be, and, and, yeah. and you'll be able to do it. I guarantee you'll be able to do it. We're going to pull oh it apart. Oh my gosh. So, to the other side. <laughs> yeah, this is good. My teachers are Steve McNye, a national account exec at CTV Globe Media, and David Newland, editor-in-chief at Canoe.ca, a.k.a. the founders of the Corktown Jam. Well, that mockingbird is going to sail away. Every Wednesday night, these two host a happy and growing group in a corner of this Toronto pub called Dominion on Queen. Those were the days. An hour of workshop, then an hour of open mic, which means a chance to strum your stuff. There's something that's quite uplifting about it. There is. It's happy. Even if, I mean, we're playing with the chords we've been playing together, our minor chords usually associated with a sense of sadness. But it is uplifting. Maybe millions of us need something cheery these days. Just surf the net for ukuleles and you'll find free lessons, performance videos, and probably a group like this near you. No, it's Eric the Hafa B. Now, $25 will get you a low-end uke, but for 85 bucks, you can feel more like a pro. It's the best money you ever spent on entertainment, and the fact is you'll play it for hundreds of hours. Props to the ukes. To the ukes. <laughs>